I fear I have been too disrespectful. Just because Diarmuid was a 3-star lance that I remembered in the game. This guy is really doing well against Saber. Two spears. First one, red one, cursed one. They're, they're both cursed. I, no, I think the gold one is the actual cursed one. But the first one, anti-mana can cut through the armor, like mana armor. That's why we went naked, but that was a bait. Then the golden cursed one pops up. Both are both noble phantasm, I think. And then this is the cursed shit where, you know, you get cut, you can't heal. Saber's fingers ain't working, but it's fine because Ryder has shown up. I don't know what he's about to do. Is he going to beat both of us right now? Let's begin today's reaction. <laughs> Leaking his identity immediately. <laughs> Shut up, pussy. <laughs> he deserves this shit. Shut up, pussy. Silence. Will we? But like, only one person can win, they get their wishes granted, but then what? Do we go on a conquest? Don't we just get sent back into the heroic realm? その提案には正直根性にて誓いを交わした。バルディ。ある<笑> Kiritsugu, <laughs> snipe waiver right now. Why wouldn't he? Kiritsugu's best interest is to kill off all the fucking masters, bro. Kill waiver. <laughs> Why not? <laughs> Archibald. <laughs> Favor. <laughs> Professor, right? Oh shit. <laughs> Yo, Waver versus Archibald would be hilarious. I mean, if you want to get back at the lecture that like disrespected you, this is the best time. Why are you showing yourself, idiot? <laughs> yeah, Waver really is a child. Like, he is not suited for this. He went in with these childish desires of wanting acknowledgement without realizing it's a fucking battle royale deathmatch. Like, what do you think is gonna happen, Waver? <laughs> it's alright, kid, you got me! さすがに貴様はこの坊主になり変わって世のマスターとなる腹だったらしいな。世のマスター、たるべき男は世と共に戦場を馳せる勇者でなければなるものなんです。役者不足の花肌シーズン。That's okay. more of a provoking a taunt, but again, it's just like Ryder's mentality, I don't think is really good for this match, right? Cuz it's all about deception and cunning and deceiving others to overcome you know, playing dirty is the theme of everyone else, but Ryder is so fucking righteous. That he just immediately shows up, leaks his identity, but glazing waver like that, it's kind of nice, you know? Give him a little credit. Really wants everyone to show up. Will they show up though? I'm not sure Tokyo Mi can even control Gilgamesh. I'm not sure, but like it's his best interest to just stay put. Just wait till the battle's over, and when people are injured, then show up and kill them. That's what I would do right now. Straight up, right? If I was Tokyomi or Kire, 
I would just wait it out, not take the provoke, let these idiots fucking fight it amongst themselves. And when there's one last survivor or some shit, I come in, kill them easy. Why isn't it good for you? Because Gilgamesh will take the bait. Oh. <laughs> well, I mean, if it's a battle of egos and shit, right? The King of Kings won't fucking back down. Uh oh. Lugunica family That's right. We have the King of Knights. We have King of Conquerors. But this guy is the King of Kings, which precedes everything, I guess. At that point, you know what we need? We need a King Slayer. Yep. Anytime you have a bullshit title like that, just add the term Slayer at the end and you're better. Mm -hmm. King you can't even tell. The gates of Babylon. Oh, damn, immediately protects ID. Nice. Good look, Saber. Good look. But, like, could. Kiritsugu is just doing nothing. What the fuck is Kiritsugu waiting for? There's so many open targets that he could just eliminate, but I don't think he could just shoot Gilgamesh here, right? There's no way Kiritsugu just snipe Gilgamesh and a bullet will kill a heroic servant like that. I refuse to believe they would go down that easily. So whenever he's using this, this is just all just noble phantasm, right? Every one of these weapons are a unique noble phantasm. Because if it was a clone, it would be a single noble phantasm. So anytime he uses the gates of Babylon, he's already fucking MP'd up. Everyone has. Uh, where's Ryunosuke at? Where's Ryunosuke and Bluebeard at? But this is an entire fucking party. <laughs> he's aware. <laughs> Saber was definitely aware. I forget the lore of this guy. I do remember this dude. I do remember this dude from the game, but I didn't read the dialogue to understand exactly why Saber would recognize Berserker here. <laughs> Gilgamesh? Yeah, he ain't taking it. Berserker? Berserker? <laughs> What? Okay. Wonder if that's like a class passive or some shit. I don't know, but like, what did the motto head say? Because Kadia is kind of weak, the base stats are low, so we need to like add some sort of. We need to use a servant class that's gonna overcome that, right? Berserker is pretty strong, but we can't also read it. It's a party here. Wait, did he? I was like, wait, wait, did Berserker literally just understand that Kirisugu has his eyes on him? I, I don't know that. The head tilt. Kadia's not saying That's for sure. Uh-oh. Is he good? What? You caught the fucking sir. Okay, this guy is insane. What in the hell? He caught it and countered it? <laughs> and 
And then he gets offended because we caught the fucking rare treasures that he has. Inu! No longer Zashu, we've been promoted to Inu. He's actually doing it. That last one, that last weapon there. I, isn't this like a special one? I vaguely recognize this one. Does anyone know this one? Do, does all of his weapons have like good, like a lore or some shit? I, I, for, I think I remember that one. Doesn't Gilgamesh sometimes use that to point it at the sky or am I thinking about something else? Uh -oh. <laughs> this guy, bro. We catch his fucking weapons to fight against it. He gets mad saying, How dare you fucking pick up our weapon? I bring you down here. Oh my god. He should be mad. He should be saying, How dare you breathe the same oxygen that I do? How dare you occupy the same space that I exist in, bro? <laughs> How big does this fucking gate to Babylon go? Berserker is actually doing so well, I'm impressed. How far can it open? I mean, his noble phantasm is just throwing weapons from his treasury though. I don't think there's any real secrets. I is there any secrets? Because so far, it just feels like he opens up portals and random weapons come out. And each random weapon is a noble phantasm. But all I see is <laughs> just generic weapon blowing up. <laughs> is there secrets? I don't know. First one to use a command spell is Tokiomi. Really? Will Gilgamesh actually listen? It would be crazy if Gilgamesh didn't like obey Tokiomi despite him using a command spell because of that's how arrogant he is. Alright, there it is. Yeah. And I guess all his weapons too can just like come back based on this just like glowing back. Alright. I'm surprised he fucking listened. That goes to show how powerful the command spells are. No one can like go against it, but wouldn't it be crazy if there was somebody that could go against the command spells? And that Berserker guy, he's straight up clutched. Like, it is crazy how well this Berserker fought against Archer. Like, insane. This stood against the entire noble phantasm of Gilgamesh. Still fucking alive. There is something there between Saber and Berserker. There's some deep lore here. They do definitely recognize each other. When Saber saw Berserker show up, Saber also made a unique reaction. <laughs> Did he convert the metal pole into his own specific weapon? It was like a generic metal pole that he picked up, pipe. But it's like getting all red. It's like converting it. What? Anything he touches become the noble Fanta? Interesting. I don't know if that's OP or not. 
I'm not too sure if that's actually OP. Because, like, what does it mean it becomes a noble phantasm? It means, like, like whatever weapon you use, it's going to be very strong, I guess. I don't think this is actually as broken as it sounds, though. Saber! Saber nerd. Saber. <laughs> Why does Kiritsugu gonna fucking go in, bro? I want Kiritsugu to do something, but Maya is still fucking stalling. Can't find a master. Bro, is it that hard to find Archibaldi right now? What's going on? Also, we're trying to find... Did we say find Assassin's Master? Berserker's Master. Kariya is well hidden somewhere else, too. Archibald's hidden. Kariya's hidden. And that's pretty much it. And Kiritsugu is hidden. Dude, the Berserker CGI is so good. Like, this is godlike CGI. It doesn't even look like it different. As in, like, it's jarring. Usually when you use CGI with 2D in frame, it looks fucking bad because of the comparison to the contrast, but it's crazy. <laughs> Mood. Wow. What a gentleman, man. It's truly a lady killer. You're interrupting our duel. You're interrupting our duel. Another command spell coming off. Assist? It is a smart thing to do right now, though. It straight up is, right? If you want to take out Saber, teaming up with Berserker right now, it is genius, but goddamn. What about the fucking Knight's Honor? What about the fucking Honor of the Duel? Like Lancer and Saber, I think they want like the sanctity of the duel to be held, but I don't think these dudes really give a fuck about that. No. You can't disobey. I'm surprised Berserker isn't like killing the Armood here. I thought Berserker would like. Just attack anyone, but I guess he got the note too. Saber. 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 You know, master of saber. You could have at least put on some fucking henna, some fake tattoos. Just fucking draw some sharpies. Who cares? Some red felt. Just draw some shit. If people can see this shit, I'm surprised no one's fucking noticed yet that this is a fucking fraudulent master. Believe in your master, you. You don't even got the command spells, bitch. Are those gloves? I don't think these are gloves, bro. These are not gloves. Yeah, we should be wearing gloves, though. Yes, we should be. But it seems like everyone has, you know, fucking, uh, uh, fucking symbols on their wrists and, and, and you know, the, this part of the fucking hand. Oh, never mind. Believe your master was not a role play from Ida's field. Never mind, never mind, never mind. Kiritsugu, Kiritsugu, he'll clutch for us. Is he gonna do something? Oh, he's moving. Kiritsugu, snipe him. Here we go, he's moving. Yon. Son. Son. Ni. Ni. Let it rip. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. 
<laughs> Raiden just clutch for us, I guess. That does help. Now Kiritsugu doesn't need to reveal his location, right? Because we were about to fucking go in. Like, we were literally about to just go in. But Ryder comes out of nowhere. And then, boom. Dunks on fucking Berserker. Look at them bulls. Ooh. That's a road kill now. Oh. Is that like a righteous thing to do? To just like run over your enemy out of fucking nowhere on a fucking chariot? Does this count as being deceptive and like cheap? I don't know, cause like, Ryder. Yeah, he's riding alright. He's not really using his blade. He's just on his fucking chair, vroom vroom motherfucker. <laughs> I'm not sure if that was a coincidence or not, but like... I don't know, fuck it, let's go. And he's gone. Toma, konna guai ni kuroi no ni wa go taiji o nega kara nozoki mi shite oru ka shiran ga. Gesu na teguchi de kishi no tatakai o kegasu de nai. Rider, saber, lancer, all very like honored. All wishing the respect to the sanctity of the duel. So it's ni haji o kakasu to yu no nara. True, and it was a two v one, and him blindsiding berserker there is actually righteous because this ensures that it's going to be a fair duel 1v1. Ooh. There it is. Until next time. Bye bye. Alright. Oh shit. Party's over! Everyone was here! Literally, Assassin, Rider, Saber, Lancer, Archer, Berserker, only Caster wasn't here. And now everyone's gone. Do we just go home now? But I still wanted Kiritsugu to fucking snipe that dude. I, I wanted Kiritsugu to go bang bang! Yeah, everyone's command spell fucking wasted. Yeah, you just want to fuck shit up. Yeah, is this injury literally gonna stay until we kill Lancer? I guess it will, huh? Because, like, it's not gonna go away. We can't heal this shit either. Maybe if we use a command spell to heal it, but that sounds kind of stupid to use a command spell for something like this. They had to nerf Saber because she's too OP. <laughs> hey kid, you should say something. Come on, we're about to leave. You up? No, he's not up. Sarama! <laughs> Oh, shit can fly. I mean, where did he come from? He descended from the heavens, but like... <laughs> I had to realize he could literally fucking fly like that, too. He got us good, dear mood. Exactly. We need to take down Lancer first. Another day living. Metaphorically. Was I protecting Saber like that? Metaphorically. Alright. Yeah, these two are a nice couple, man. Mm -hmm. I think the biggest losers of this mat round. La uh, mo definitely Lancer, Archer, Saber, right? And that's funny. <laughs> All three great knight classes are just at the most disadvantage. They, they got fucked the most here. Because both Lancer and Archer wasted a command spell. And Saber got like an injury that's just going to be hindering. Ryder had the most fun. Berserker, he put up a good show. I don't know what, what he's up to. And Assassin was just chilling. Ryder definitely got the best though. He just showed up, fucked shit up, left, based. <laughs>
Archie. Karia, Karia. Yeah, you did. Tokiomi, Kisama no Hoys. The worms, man. Ew. He literally pukes out worms, bro. Ew. <laughs> I'm about to say something completely unhinged. So when he nuts, do you think there's also worms in the nut? I'm thinking yes. Sakura, no! Kire? Hi. Oh? Familiar. I'm not sure. Do we have any hints? Oh, isn't this just us? Isn't this isn't that just a camera? Isn't that like us? But is it a familiar though? Because, like, we are... I, it, it is us, right? I'm pretty sure it is. It, it, the, the word familiar made me think that it was some kind of magical people, but looking at the fucking camera just fucking on the bottom of the leg, it, it's fucking us, right? Kiritsuku's got his eyes on you. <laughs> what did they do it, bro? Ryunosuke and Bluebeard, they didn't, they didn't give a fuck about the battle royale. They, what are they doing? I got no clue. They're killing shit, though. <laughs> Bluebeard, you there? He's crying. Why are you crying, bro? Saber, right? Because Gillis' entire thing is simping for Jean. Jean and Saber both has the Saber face, right? <laughs> Amazing voice acting. <laughs> but that's but that's Jean though, right? That's the lore. This is King of Arthur, but I think he's just mistaking her for the face, right? <laughs> Holy virgin. <laughs> Ew, bro. He's straight up getting confused with a different girl. Howl of a mad beast. And I think that is basically Berserker. At least the title is referring to Berserker. And that's today's episode. I don't think there's a post credit scene. Okay. So, Ryunosuke and Bluebeard. They're just like... Doing whatever the fuck they want. Bluebeard has found that Saber does exist right now, but he's like mistaking it for Jean. Therefore, he has a reason to go battle in the Holy Grail War, I guess. Until this, I guess he didn't have any motivations, but I guess this is it to just get in the fray. This whole first sequence of battles is fucking hype. A bit anticlimactic in the sense that everyone just kind of went home without anyone dying. But still super hype because like everybody showed up except the caster. Ryder's entire thing is all about glory. Having a righteous, glorious battle with everybody. He's not afraid to just leak his name. He doesn't give a fuck. Saber and Lancer, they all have this knight's honor to have the sanctity of the duel respected. But with everyone, you know, interrupting, we can't really have you having that. <laughs> Gilgamesh literally exists <laughs> like at a higher place. Because he does not want to be on the same fucking level of existence, which is so funny. Also, lore-wise, he is the king of kings, therefore every other king here doesn't matter. Since a king of kings would be just, you know, trumping every other king. His attacks, I think these are all individual noble phantasm. The gates of Babylon, it just keeps increasing, increasing. And the craziest shit is, Berserker's performance against Gilgamesh was fucking crazy. And why is that? Is it because that Berserker, whatever he touches, also turns into a noble phantasm? So essentially, Gilgamesh is handing over already powerful weapons to Berserker as, you know, attacks. 
But Berserker catches that shit, and now the weapon that he is holding is even more amplified. Thus, Berserker was just able to put on a show like this. I think that's what's happening. Berserker and Saber also seem to have a very, uh, they have a very close connection. And if I paid attention <laughs> in the Knights that Round Table arc, if I actually read the lore, I probably understand exactly what's going on with Berserker. But hey, I don't know what the fuck is going on there. There's a special connection between Saber and Berserker. Um, Lancer right now obviously has given us a curse, you know, the, the cursed injury, you know, the thumb isn't working, so we're kind of nerfed right now. We gotta take down Lancer first. Ryder helps us out. Everything's looking good, but bro, I wanted Kiritsugu to just fucking go in. When is my man Kiritsugu gonna go in and put a fucking stop to all these fucking roleplay knights, bro? Fuck these pussy ass knights and their sanctity of the duel. I want kids to just go show up and just blow shit up and say, fuck your honor and respect. All I care about is results. And that's it for me. If you're still here though, if you enjoyed this reaction, please like the video. Check out the other playlist for even more content. And until next time, take care.